look like little fairy umbrellas. Perfect for the weather that we're having today. Hi, I Anna. know. <laughs> hey, Michelle. How's it going? So what are these? So this is dollar weed. Dollar weed is a common weed here in Florida. Maybe you've seen it in your garden. Yes, I, I've noticed that they tend to spread real quick. Yes, they do tend to spread, and that's because the biology of this little weed is pretty impressive, but it doesn't mean that it's welcome in our garden. So really, a weed is anything growing in a place where you don't want it to grow. So if it's in your plant bed and you don't want it to be growing there or in your turf grass in your homeowners association, does not want it growing there, then it might be a problem that you need to think about controlling. So what are some of the ways that we can control it? Well, so um, understanding that this thing really has two different ways of spreading is important in understanding how we control it. You can see we've got flowers. That's mm -hmm. where the seeds ultimately are produced. So this thing can spread by seed, but it can also spread by rhizomes where these make these daisy chains here oh. and they can continue to spread via rhizome underneath your soil. And that's how you see these things just clumping and spreading. Um, but the wetter conditions are a lot more favorable to mm -hmm. this weed. So especially in a turf grass situation, we tend to see areas that are a little bit more overwatered might have more issues with dollar weeds. So simply backing off on irrigation if it's a turf grass situation situation okay. might be enough to alter the environment to where you don't even need to use chemicals. And can you just scoop it out and call it a day? <laughs> um, in, in plant beds and things like that, there are definitely some ways that you can manually remove it. Just make sure you're following these chains and making sure that you're um, not letting it spread beyond where it is located. Fantastic. Well, Hannah, thank you so much for telling me more about these weeds and how to take care of them. Yes, absolutely. Thanks, Michelle.